Hey guys, I want to give you an update on the filter back exhaust. I've gotten a lot of comments saying, you know, is it worth it? Sounds like a waste of money and um, pretty much you guys are right on that one. There's almost no sound change. There's no power difference. The only good thing would be is that it's a little lighter and I think it looks good. Looks clean, looks factory, looks more like a diesel and less like a gas truck. For $125 or $135, um, you know, since I'm not going to delete the truck, I mean, trust me, I want to delete the truck. For being able to keep that factory warranty intact, it's very important to me considering this truck had a major mechanical issue when I first got it. But that's, that's a story for a whole nother video. So if you guys want to hear about that, leave a comment below or something and I'll make a video on that. But overall, I would say it's not worth it for power or sound. If you like the way it looks, which I think it looks pretty good. Makes it look clean, factory, but yeah, that's pretty much it on the exhaust. So now let's get to the other part of the video. Wheels and tires. Got these wheels and tires from customoffsets.com. Pretty good, got them a pretty good deal. I was trying to go for something more cheap than anything. That's what I was trying to, I was trying to get something that looked good and yet it was still pretty cheap. So these setup right here cost about $1,600. That's with tire pressure sensors, you know, mount balance, everything shipped right to your door. Pretty nice. And this video is no way sponsored by them either. I just, just like the setup I got here so far. Tires are 35s. I'll do a close up of everything here in a second. See, it doesn't stick out too far. These tires here are Kanadi Trail Hogs. I think they're pretty good. I mean, haven't seen that many videos or anything about them. Um, pretty cheap tire. Got the whole set for, I think it was 800, and then the wheels together, I think it was about 600. So, pretty good deal. But, see, he's got a lot of tread on them. Almost look like a BFG, like the KO2s in the middle more knobby on the outside. These are race line Raptor rims. These are 18 inch. Let's see here, let me find the tire thing. These are 305 70 R18s. The rims are a negative six offset with um, four and three quarter inch back spacing. You can see here, I'll do some measurements here, show you guys exactly how much it sticks out. So everyone out there is trying to figure out the perfect offset because that was something that took a real long time trying to figure that out. All right, I'll set up over here. Let me switch hands. As you can see I got, got my little magnet here. I got my measuring tape. Get right up here, level. So in the back, it is about about almost three inches. And then here, I'll take this up to the front. And you can see up here too. Put that on. All right, here we go. That and then right, right there. It's a little bit more than three inches. This is about three and a quarter. Let me try to get this perfect. Looking right down the side. There, it's about three and a half up front. So you stick out, you know, good amount, a little aggressive, but here, let me get this. They're a little aggressive. Probably need some fender flares soon, but I think they look pretty nice. I've noticed a little bit of a decrease in fuel economy. That's something to note. I mean, now about one or two. This thing's getting about 21, and now it's getting about 18. And then um, for sound, these things are pretty quiet. I'm pretty surprised at how quiet they are. I mean, you notice about about 60 miles an hour, you can start to hear them, and then they're not, they don't get loud as something like a, some other tires. So that's the update on the truck. If you guys want to hear about what went wrong with the truck, 
I first got it. And the reason why I would definitely want to keep that factory warranty with the exhaust and everything. Then leave a comment down below, like the video, subscribe. And I'll make another video about that. Here, I'll just give you guys one good walk around. You guys see everything. And there's the truck. Got new wheels, new tires. This is pretty much how it's gonna stay for a while. So I'll give you guys an update on how the tires wear and everything, cause I don't know, it's something brand I've never heard of. So definitely get back to you guys on that and see ya.